Good day to you people, my name is Thomas and welcome back to The Cat Lady. Last time we left off we discovered that apparently there are these things called parasites where they're just people who are bonkers and we are supposed to get rid of them. So let us begin. And also we, um, we woke up in the hospital. So, I suppose, let's get started. Bed, lie down. Mm. Oh. I don't, I don't really want to sleep here. I'm not tired anyways. Oh, okay. Band, uh, examine. It's a clip, it's a clip on hospital wristband. It's got my name, birth of date, and hospital number on it. Okay. Hmm, how can I, this help me from this horrible place? Oh, okay. Yeah, we're planning to escape, so... And I forgot how you... Oh, there we go. Lock. You need to say the clock. It's probably broken. Yeah, yeah. Oh, hang on, what was that? Gloves rack. It's on a... It's full of lax gloves. These are different sizes. Take the gloves. Take one or a lot. I'll take one, just in... You know. Okay, so... Wait, wait, hang on, hang on, what was that? What was that? Hang on, there was... Oh, never mind. Oh, it's a sink. Turn cold water on, turn hot water on, turn tap off. I don't know what's the point. Side room one, this is where I'm staying. Hopefully not much longer. Drug chart. B. It's a list of drugs for patients to inside. I guess that's me then. I'm on a lot of sentences, it appears. The stuff they are giving me could knock out a horse and give it a headache for a week or two. It could also cause hallucinations and paranoia. How bizarre. Why would they want to give me all of that? I'm not crazy. I know that for sure. If anyone's crazy here, it's someone who put me on all of this medicine for no good reason. Uh, uh, for no good reason. Ah, so apparently this hospital is not very good. Uh, flowers. I don't like flowers. I don't really care what they smell like. Okay, fine. Jeez. A bunch of crate. A bunch of cherry symptoms. I hate flowers. <laughs> I hate flowers. Reminds me of Francis from Left 4 Dead. No way I'm taking that. I don't like flowers. Okay, fine. Oh, wait, 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 wait. What if we use the glove? I don't need that right now. Okay, fine. Jeez. Um, what the door? Examine. So I room too. They must be keeping another suicidal nutcase in there. Let's enter. Oh, no one's home. Uh... The bed, nah. Pillow. Examine. Dirty looking pillow. Look under. What's under it? There's nothing interesting under the pillow. Okay, that was a waste of my time. Uh. Truck chart. Read. There's a list of drugs with the patient inside room one and some notes. According to this, her name is Anne Burton. 35 years of age. She's taken lots of sedative and has a long history of drug abuse. It seems that on top of all, she's taking method methadone for heroin withdrawal syndrome. At the bottom of the page, there's a note saying she's actually a private patient who's studying here out of her own free will. Lucky lady, I guess it won't be easy, easy for me to leave the this ward. Oh, hello. Nurse, talk to. Um... I feel much better now. Can you please discharge me? I feel much better now. Can you please discharge me? I'm glad to hear that. But I can't discharge you until Dr. X sees you. He should be doing his round very soon. Please return to your bed and wait for him, alright? Okay. Um, is Liz here? Is Liz here? And who's Liz? That young nurse who was here last night. Black hair, very chatty. She said her name was Liz. Uh, I'm sorry, a lot of people come through here. I can't remember everyone's name. Can you return to your bed now, please? It's nearly time for your medication. I can't be chasing around after every single patient. Beg your pardon? Look, I'm very busy at the moment. I'll come and talk to you in a minute, alright? Okay, jeez. 
discharge letter. A discharge letter for Anne Burton, currently a patient in Cyber One, is usually she has admitted herself into hospital and is what and is allowed to leave whenever she wishes. Uh, Please do not touch these. They are all confidential documents. Yeah? Okay. Well, maybe you shouldn't leave them out on the desk for everyone to see. If you are looking for something to read, we have some magazines for patients here. Thanks, but I think I'll pass. I don't really think we can touch the folders. Security, talk to. Um. Excuse me. Where's the exit? It's just down the corridor, ma'am. Thanks. I'll be on my way then. Can I see the discharge letter first? A discharge letter? What for? Some of our patients are under observation and aren't allowed out of the ward. For their own safety, of course. It sounds like we're prisoners here. It's for the patient's safety, ma'am. If you haven't been discharged by the doctors, I'm afraid I can't let you through. May I ask what your name is? Um... My name, is Susan. My name is Susan Ashworth. Can I go now? If you've not been discharged, I can't let you out, Mrs. Ashworth. Okay, fine. I'm afraid there's nothing I can do for you, Mum. You should talk to the doctor first and come back with a letter and some form of identification. Okay, so we'll probably, we'll probably need to see Dr. X first. And then... Oh, hello. What's going on here? Oh, oh, oh. There must be a patient. That, this must be the patient from side room too. God, she, God, doesn't she look confused? Patient. Uh, look at. Another suicidal patient. Strange. She, she looks like someone I know. Talk to. Hi. Are you alright? Can we talk for a minute? I can't talk. Please, just leave me alone. Oh, I mean you no harm. I'm trapped here, just like you. Trapped? I don't know. It's just so hard to think without it. But you're a stranger. And you're not one of those lovely nurses either. They look after me so well. I trust the nurses like I trusted my mother. I just want to talk. I need your help. Unless... It's mother who sent you. Was it her? Please tell me it was her. Um, yeah, sure. I'm a good friend of your mother. I miss her so much. I can't remember you very well. But you should know this. If you really are a friend, you will know my mother's name. Uh... The name that haunts me. A beautiful name. Uh... Yeah, sure I do. Now, let me ask you. What is it? Oh, well... What is my mother's name? Hmm... Uh... Joan Mary Elizabeth Bendy. Is it for side room one? I think it was Mary. Was, I'm pretty sure it was Mary. Mary? No, you're wrong. Uh, leave me alone. Please, just leave me alone. Oh, for Fine. Okay, looks like... Right. It uh, seems that the only way we're going to make a talk. I feed is the patient, according to my name. Anne. Anne. It has to be Anne. Anne, Anne, Anne. Talk to you. If you really are a friend, you will know my mother's name. The name that haunts me. A beautiful name. But I know it. Let me just think for a second. And, oh, oh crap, it's not there. Uh, oh, wait. Anne Burton. Anne Burton. No, that's my name. You don't know my mother, you little liar. Leave me alone. Please, just leave me alone. <laughs> okay, fine, whatever. Okay, door. Examine. It's a toilet door. Oh, okay. Maybe there's, a, maybe there's something in the toilet. Okay, what do we have? Um, it looks like it hasn't been empty for a while. There's a lot of discounted medication parts and uh, another manga gross stuff. Search. Oh, golly, I have to say. I'll take one of these medication parts. Okay. 
think one call for it, so yeah. Stop running right now. Yeah, that, exactly. I can't look I can't look at myself. The mirror is cracked. A large shard of glass is lying on the side. Belt. Press. Someone is coming. Okay. Have you rang the bell? Is there an emergency? Um, I just wanted to remind you that I'm ready to go home. I put my mistake, sorry. I wanted to see how long it takes you to answer the bell. I think a bit um I pressed it by mistake, sorry. I pressed it by mistake. Sorry. Oh. Alright. It happens, I guess. I'll see you later. Father filthy flush Use his father filthy no. uh, open lid look at his father filthy yeah 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 Okay that was I don't really see the point of that Mirror no Oh wait there's a note read Please stop writing uh, please start messaging messages on the mirror while we are currently we are currently experiencing difficulties with maintaining a high level of cleanliness due to sudden absence of our cleaning staff. We ask all patients to be considerate and help us keep the ward tidy. Ah, so I bet there's a parasite in here. Okay, so apparently I need to figure out her mother's name. Okay, that's her room. Nurse discharge letter. Oh, there's an examine. Let's be the page as far as the body of the Please do not touch these. They are all confidential documents. I was only going to tidy up. I'm sorry. Are you one of the housekeepers? Why did you dress up as a patient? I just can't stand mess, that's all. And there's no need to be sarcastic. Who's being sarcastic? You. Okay. So that's not gonna happen. Uh, Anne Burton, currently a patient in the Watch. It, it seems she admitted herself into hospital until now. Blah, blah, blah. Uh. Sorry, ma'am, can't let you through. We'll need to see a discharge letter from your doctor first. Right. It seems that a discharge letter is the only ticket out of here. Uh, I don't know what to do. Ah, what do I do? Am I? Okay, you know what, I'm gonna... Someone is coming. Have you rang the bell? Is there an emergency? Yeah, I'm feeling a bit... I'm feeling a bit woozy. Are you really? You look fine to me. No, I I'm really not feeling well. Fine, I'll call the doctor for you. But I can't help it if he's busy and can't get here straight away. In the meantime, I know how to make you feel better. I think it's time we give you some medication. Can you please tell me your name and your date of birth? Susan Ashworth, 24th of May, 1970. I'm just going to check your name band now to confirm that. That's fine. That's fine. I'd like you to drink this liquid, please. It will help you relax. It will help you relax. Or as I like to call it, paranoia! Uh, take the drugs. That's a good girl. Now, drink it down. I don't like it when You'll you... You'll feel much better. I don't... I don't like it when you say that. That's a good girl. It just, I mean, it just makes you sound like a porn star. Am I now? Okay. Okay, it said something. S-H-A. Like, can't... Now, if I keep going on to the side over there, I bet I can find something. God, I just don't like that sound. I can't go in there. Oh my god! What the hell? Okay. 
Oh, is this thing filled with drugs? I don't know, but I want to kill it now. News. Vinegar is jumping out. No way. So, I've got to is this thing filled with drugs? I don't know what that was, but I, I think I might have done something. And then flush. Okay. Push it. Press the bell. Wait for the scene to call the nurse again. While she, um, uh, while she is unblocking the toilet, walk to the nurse's station and get to this time. What? Oh, right. Okay. All oh, right. Call for the call for assistance. Someone is coming. Yeah, yeah. Uh, Have you rang the bell? Is there an emergency? Well, the, toilet the toilet's blocked. What? Ah, oh, well, that's hardly an emergency. It is when you need to use it urgently, like I do. I see. Fine, I'll sort it out. Just give me a minute. Oh, yes, you will. Ah, oh, it's the gloves. Again! I guess I'll have to get my hands dirty, since the cleaner's called in sick. Yes, go into that. Ah, uh -uh. then I get the discharge notes, and then I will, you know, <laughs> get the discharge notes, I think. Yes, you would need to go home, then bye-bye. Sorry, ma'am, can't let you through. We'll need to see a discharge letter from your doctor first. Here. Are you happy now? Yes, that seems fine. Can I just check your name band to confirm that you are indeed Anne Burton? Oh, oh right. Name band. I will go and get that. I think I left it in my room. I'll go and get it, shall I? Okay, then I need to go and get the band. Yes, she does. Ah, uh, fuck me. Okay, so I've discovered um the first three letters. You have to buy the hot water tap. Have you rang the bell? Is there an emergency? Right, I'm feeling a bit woozy. I'm feeling a bit woozy. Are you really? Are you? You look fine to me. No, I I'm really not feeling well. Fine, I'll call the doctor for you, but I can't help it if he's busy and can't get here straight away. In the meantime, I know how to make you feel better. I think it's time we give you some medication. Can you please tell me your name and your date of birth? Susan Ashworth, 24th of May, 1970. I'm just going to check your name band now to confirm that. That's fine. That's fine. I'd like you to drink this liquid, please. It will help you relax. It will help you relax. Yeah, yeah. Boom. That's a good girl. Now, drink it down. Don't tell me like that. Much better. Blah, 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 blah. So I need to go to the, I need to go to the heart, and apparently I need to get its blood from it. Sheila. 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 Let's remember that. Sheila. Now I need to go to the thing. Use. I 
get rid of this drug. Okay, now I've got the thing. And then... Oh, for goodness sake. I don't like this place. Stop whispering in my ear! Oh, God! Oh, 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 God! No, stop it! Please stop! Oh, no, no, come on! Get sleep, sleep! This is too disturbing! Please, just lie down, lie down, lie down! Oh, for goodness sake! Much better. Okay. The drugs have worn off and I feel better now. But I can't let them do that to me again. I need to get out of here. Well, you don't say, Susan. What do you think I've been trying to do? Okay, then. Talk to? If you really are a friend, you will know my mother's name. It is she that the I name can. that haunts me. A beautiful name. But I know it. Let me just think for a second. It's Sheila. Sheila. Yes. It was my mother who sent you, after all. I don't I'm sorry it. I didn't believe you. Da, da, da. But my head's all messed up. So, let's have a little chat, sweetheart. Do you know um, how to get out of here? Something's wrong with this place. Um, something's, wrong. something's wrong with this place. I think it's really nice here. We must stay here. Do what they say. Take pills they give us. Sometimes, if I behave, they give me the red stuff. What's I the wait red for stuff? it. I'm being good. What is this red. red stuff? It's a drug. My favorite one. Red stuff takes the pain away. I must stay here. Good nurses have been most kind. They always remember. They know I'm suffering. But it is not the same as the drugs I see in my dreams. On the other side of the mirror, there's a spider's heart full of drugs. I just can't seem to find it anymore. I see. Look, what exactly um, is this little treat you mentioned? Are you alright? Feel like showing what's your name? How about we swap our name bands? How about we swap our name bands? Oh yeah, I don't mind. But that would be like a favor to you, yeah? Well, technically, you wouldn't lose anything, because I'd give you my name band instead. Does that make any sense? Sure, yeah. I do want something better in return, though. I'm not that stupid. I know you'll use it to get out of here. Oh, I never said you're stupid. I... I just really want to go home. Please understand. That's fine. I don't mind. I'll give it to you if you get me the red stuff. What do you say? I thought nurses give it to you anyway. No, not that. I'm talking about the real thing. Something you can only get in the world of dreams. Which I wow, have. Wow, that is something special. Is it safe? It's perfectly safe. I bet it's um, not. Okay. I'll see what I can do. Okay. Uh, what exactly is this What little exactly treat? is this little treat you mentioned? It's the red teardrop of pure happiness. They bring it. I drink it down, and my pain goes away. Without it, I just feel so angry. It's like I'm going crazy. <laughs> it's funny, but. I just get so fucking angry sometimes. Okay, okay. Yeah, I'm sure. dying, I think. We're all dying, I heard. She said I'd go to hell for it, but I didn't do anything. I didn't know. Does he know? Who? Who? Him! Him? Who? Him? Right. Okay. No, probably not. I need the red medicine. I need it now. Luckily, lady, I must be a I... good girl. I must be a nice girl. Luckily, maybe I could get you some of that stuff. Do you know where they keep it? Oh, they have it hidden well. You can't get there. Or maybe you can. In the world of I see it in my dreams sometimes. It's where the nurses are. But in my dream, there are no nurses there. I see it, but I can't. 
get it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's so I near, got it. and yet so far. I can still hear the broken heartbeat of the spider's heart. Whatever! Okay, so... Um, how do I... About... Okay, I'll talk to you later, yeah? Yes. Go. Be careful. They're watching us. And remember, we must be nice to earn the red stuff. Always be nice. Poor woman. Okay, now that I have the red stuff, give. Hey, you I've go. found the thing you asked me for, but are you absolutely certain it won't harm you? Don't be silly. Of course it won't. I bet it is. Fine. I hope you know what you're doing. Can I have your name band now, please? Yes. No matter what they say, I do keep my promises. What do they... You know what? It doesn't matter. Thank you for your help. Sorry, ma'am, can't let you through. We'll need to see a discharge letter from your doctor first. Oh, wait, have I been... Here. Are you I... happy now? Oh, God, I think yes, I've... Ah, oh, oh, crap, I think I'm... Can I just check your name, Ben, to confirm that you are indeed Anne Burton? Oh, all right. I didn't realise you knew how to read. Oh! There you go. Can I go now? Of course. Thank you, ma'am. We'll see you soon. <laughs> no, you won't. Now get out of my way. Okay, now we're progressing. I'll have to cut a lot of the footage. Uh, it's locked. Yeah, that's locked as well. Dying war, manatee. Oh, oh god! Oh, hi! Yeah, that and you must be Susan Ashworth. Hi, Susan. Um, well, perhaps I am. Hi there. Do you me. mind if I ask you where you're heading to? I was just going for a little walk. Stretch my legs, get some fresh air. Oh, I'm trying to go home! Oh, hi. Give it a rest. I'm not going anywhere. Miss Ashworth, please relax. There's no. been a mistake. You have been prescribed wrong medication. No. I apologize sincerely on behalf of my team and the hospital. But luckily we managed to spot it on time. What? On time. You have no idea what I've been through. Once again, I'm truly sorry. I promise no more drugs will be given to you. Okay, can I go? I personally guarantee you will have a good, peaceful sleep tonight. And you can be discharged in the morning. Oh, I can be Why can't I go now. tonight? I want to go now. I'm really sorry, but we can't legally discharge suicidal patients. Without a full psychiatric assessment. It's too late for it now. But I promise we'll have a chat in my office first thing in the morning, okay? And then you can go home. Is that all right? I haven't really got much choice, have I? Now I'd like to ask you some questions about your life, Susan. You might find them very personal. But it's important that you answer me as honestly as possible. Yeah, yeah, Fine. I'll be, I'll be Let's get it over with then, shall we? Excellent. We are nearly done here. What do you mean we're done? Well, there's done. just one more thing I must clear with you. Uh, what is that? What exactly happened last night? Well, after I'd met you outside the ward yesterday, Wait, why is I that? went back to my room and fell asleep. I slept really well, considering what happened earlier. But then someone woke me up. It was the same nurse who was so friendly with me the first night. She said we needed to talk. We must go, Susan. You are not safe here. But... Please, you must follow me. Quickly. Wait, what? Oh, wait, oh, wait, what, 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 what? I went after her. The ward seemed very quiet. It must have been late at night. Wait, what happened? What's happening at the moment? 
Hurry! Wait for me. Tell me what's going on here. I don't know what, but okay. The security guys were gone. She pointed at the corridor and said, You go first. I'll explain everything in a minute. Um, okay, corridor. Go to the corridor. Susan, if we don't escape now, they're going to hurt you. Please trust me. I know a way out of here. I'll help you escape. Let's go down this corridor. I'll be right behind you. Oh, you better be. Oh, um, apparently she's not following me. I think I can hear someone coming. Damn it! We can't go through there. Let's turn back, Susan. I know another way. Okay, yeah, sure, go first. Turn left here. We can use the maintenance lift to get us out of this place. I don't know what's going on, but uh, apparently I'm escaping through the ward. Oh, this is just lovely. What is happening? Um, oh, okay. Wait for me. What are we doing on the roof? Liz. Oh. What the hell are you doing? Oh, no. And why is there blood on your clothes? Liz. It's quicker than the stairs. And besides, all the doors are locked anyway. Why are you on the roof? This is the only way out of here. No! The only escape. No! Oh god. Let's both jump. It won't hurt, you'll see. Oh god, no. Uh, you flashed your mind, get down from right now. This is a bad idea, come down and This we'll is talk. a bad idea. Come down and we'll talk. I've made up my mind. I need to end this suffering now. What do you mean you besides, end up? I have no one to live for anyway. Yes, you do. No one ever listened to me. No one ever cared. I listened to you. I listened. You're a nice girl. You have your whole life ahead of you. You listened. Did you really? Yes, I of did. Of course I did. You talk a lot, but I've always been a good listener. I liked talking to you. So do you remember that story then? The one I told you the other night? The one about the woman in A&E? A&E? Uh, she's just a check. Oh, God damn it. She smoked a cigarette and burned in dirt. Come on, if it's in the last video. Yo, come on, come on, come on. Okay, come on. She smoked it. She smoked. Uh, wait. Yeah, yeah. She smoked a cigarette, but then as soon as she left, she wanted to go for another one, and then she burned to death. Go yeah. Th she smoked a cigarette and burned in bed. Okay. Oh, you have you. listened. Maybe you're right. Or maybe it was just a blind guess. That was right! But I must jump anyway. I have no choice. Oh, come on, no! Wait! Please stop and think for a second. Oh, please don't Did you me. not hear what I said? I have no choice. Yes, you do. Yes, you do. You can choose to come back inside with me, and we'll just forget this like it never happened, okay? Do you remember that other thing I told you? What? I'm sure I told you about my flatmates. Oh, fuck. Did I tell you what one of them oh, does fuck. for a living? Oh, fuck. I bet you don't remember that. Oh, come on, come on. What was it? What was it? What was it? What was it? Stripper! Stripper! She was a stripper. She's a stripper. Yes. <sighs> or at least that's what I think she is. Oh. You've listened. I just wish other people did. Ooh. I'm sure they do. <laughs> it can't be that yeah! bad. What do you know? Why do you care anyway? Baker. I don't want you to make the same mistake I did. I thought you of all people knew how it feels when you're trapped and you can't trust anyone. Look, I'm sure there must be someone who cares about you. Like me. My colleagues don't care. My family don't care. What? Even my fucking boyfriend never cared. Oh. He said he needed to go find himself. Did I tell you when he broke up with me? On Valentine's On Day. On Valentine's Day. Yes. Valentine's Day. You and I could have been good friends, you know. 
You really listened to everything I said after all. Come on, I, jump down. I'll be jump back. Down, jump when you need down, help. Jump down. I'll be there, Susan. But right now, it's time for me to let go. Don't come in. No. No, 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 no. Uh ah. Uh. What? I listened to you! Mother God! Oh. Oh, why? Oh, why? 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 After that, I went back. Why? I tried telling people about Liz. But they all thought I was crazy again and didn't believe me. And you were absolutely sure you saw Liz jump off this building? You know, it doesn't matter. I just want to finish this and get some fresh air. Susan, I know Liz well. She wouldn't do something like that. As a matter of fact, I saw her this morning. She's fine. I'd like you to come with me and see her. Say hi. Make sure she's all right. Stop treating me like I'm crazy. Fine. I'll go. I don't even care that much anyway. Okay. Oh, it's locked. The door is locked? I plan ahead, Sus. I had a feeling in my gut, and my gut's never wrong. I feel like I really got to know you, though. I'm very sorry you've had such a difficult life. What are you doing? Get away! I like your green eyes Stop it. and your sleek cheekbones. Stop it! You're a no, no, girl, no, 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 Who, who are you? I am the crow, of course. I will get you out of here. Unless you don't want to think. No. I thought so. There are two doors leading out of this place. One of them will simply take Susan back to where she belongs. But behind the other one, there is a great reward for her. It's something she always wanted. Something she longs for every single day. Okay. Where are those doors? I can't see them. Just walk back to the right side of the stage. I knew it as soon as I can't miss them. Walk to the back right. Left right. I have to go back. Ah, that's Oh, what the hell is that? That's Susan what is girls. that? What is that? That is scary. No, thank you. Whatever they are, tell them to stop staring. But they are here to guide, Susan. They are the guardians of the doors. Okay, yeah, they know which door she should enter to get the rewards. But there is one problem. Oh, is that one problem. There's always a problem. I'm not even surprised. Which door should I go through? I'm going to leave that to Susan's own best judgment. But this might be her only chance to find what she had lost. Waste it. And Susan will never get it back. Susan has one question. And she can only ask one of them. She must use it wisely. Fine. I can do 
that. But what's the catch? It's very simple. One of my cats always tells the truth, while the other one always lies. Always lies. Always and I'm guessing you can't tell me which is which? It's something I've forgotten myself a long time ago, Susan. But does it really matter? What I'm questioning is also the leads to find the right door. Okay, so... Oh my god, this is creepy. Oh my god, I don't like it! Okay, so... One of them always tells the truth. Whilst the other one always tells a lie. Insults. Oh my god. Uh, hmm. Left or right? Right is always right. Uh, oh my god. I'm, I'm going to regret this. Okay. So, which door should. Which door will lead me to my reward? Which door will lead me to my reward? I can't ask the doll. I'm gonna go for the dark one. What is that noise? Oh my god, what is happening? What is happening? I don't like this. What is happening? Oh, what is that? Is a hospital body bag open? Body bag. Open. What's in the body bag? Come on. Come on. Well, that's my dead body. You treacherous, dirty bastard. I opened my heart to you, and you stabbed me to death in cold blood. You'll pay for this. I swear you will. But this means the old woman was right. I can't I'm die. I'm, I'm immortal. immortal. <laughs> I think it's time to find out how very mortal you are, Doctor. Iron bar, say. Give me the iron bar. I don't know. What's this? My name is Susan Asworth, and even in the pantry flat. Is this the suicide note? Or why would he put it on there? Guess he's crazy, of course. Another unlucky victim of the killer. This one looks like she's been dead for a very long time. What about the other one? She's been sliced in half. Oh, I like this a lot! Yeah! Let's go and kill the doctor! Oh, I don't know, I, I just skipped a lot of dialogue by accident. Oh. So, take. I don't know what I'm taking for now. Yeah, it could be useful. Maybe to clean myself. It's covered in leather now. Very useful. Oh, this is. I think we're there. This body is quite badly decomposed already. While we are last forever, Doctor Models will soon fall apart. That sick man. How did he manage to hide all this madness? Some doll. I guess I couldn't be able to use this creepy doll and instead take the doll's head. I should probably find some. 
think of sight. It seems this place closed down for a very long time ago. One day, when they eventually demolish it, will all the um, all the evidence will get very deep in the of pieces of rubble. Oh, hello there. Oh, there's Liz. God, it's Liz. But it's impossible. I spoke to her last night. I tried to stop her from jumping. And yet, here she is, stuck on a metal rod. Looks like she's been dead for a lot longer than that. Ah, oh, damn it. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, she's been... Or, what happened then? Was it a dream? Am I really going crazy? Or was she really there, just already dead? Such bugger. The buckets are empty. Take down. Come on, I want to take you down. I hope yeah, at least you will find some peace and death. Key. Thank you. I think that might be locked. I think that's where the key comes in. Or maybe not. Oh. Challenge. So, uh, the key switch is uh, to a last band. That's what we were told. It says, dreams are just dreams. Pinch me. I can't wake them. Didn't this say something similar the night I met her? Enter. I can leave now and forever forget about this place and Dr. X. I have my own problems. I'm not cut out to bring murderers to justice. Wait, what? I've got the key. It's clearly been left here for me to find. Was it Liz who did it? If it really was her, it's clear she would have wanted me to leave. If she'd planned a revenge, surely she would have left me a fucking gun instead. Can I just... No, I'm supposed to kill the parasite. On the other hand, this man is a serial killer. He murdered a lot of women. He murdered me. He will carry on killing if I don't put a stop to it. And I'm pretty sure none of those brain-dead idiots upstairs will believe my story. Just like when I told them about Liz on the roof. They'll never take my word over the doctors. I'm just a fucked up loser to them. But they're screaming. He's got someone in there. His next victim. It's probably too late to save her. But what if it isn't? I, want to I told the old lady I'm not a killer. I want to save that lady. Maybe I'm wrong. I want to save that lady. I've never tasted vengeance before. Not like this. What if it feels good? Or maybe you're just a psychopath. It's time to decide. Do I stay and fight? Or leave and carry on with my life like all this never happened? Stay or leave? I'm gonna kill old Dr. X. Let's go and kill him. Oh, it's the Mother Lisa! Hi there! You look pretty really disgusting. Ah, oh, crap, I skipped a lot of dialogue again. You're gonna pay for this, you bastard. Okay, okay. One of these, uh, it. it seems... It seems he used a lot of makeup to turn her into this spotting image of Mona Lisa. Skeleton, examine. I think skeleton had probably been used for teaching before it's ended up here. Vault. A large metal ball used for one of the shots to take it. That could be useful. Easel, examine. The doctor probably considers himself quite an artist. Revenge, examine. I could probably make a weapon here. Use. Iron bar. So, can't do anything with soup here. Lost head. The bot appears to secure the place, otherwise, the will just fall apart. I need this bite size enough to secure the bot. Oh wait, that's something. Venus, look at the hand. Yes, that's what I need! 
A metal nut is stuck to the finger being. I, well, I could pull it off the, off the finger, it wouldn't be swollen and stuff. I could put it off if the finger wasn't all swollen and stiff. I look for these pictures in the way, it seems to kill out of wires. Okay, what's in the last one? Let's open it quietly. Aha! Don't worry, I'll save you in a sec. Just... Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on. Yeah, yeah, I know, I know. I can use it. Just let me use the street. I'm sure I can find it used for someone else. Well, f find them. Jeez. Oh, I God. don't need eyes to enjoy your fear. Scream louder, little bitch. Scream your lungs out. Louder, I said. Yes, this is by far my favorite of songs. Would you like me to dance for you? Unlike you, I know all art needs to be appreciated. Your scream is like a poem without words. Your body. An instrument. I never thought you had it in you. And yet you make every fiber in my body tremble with excitement. Your body will forever be admired by those like me who understand the only pure and true form of art. Okay, can I go now? Got a weapon. Wait, wait, wait. Hang on. Wait, what if I use the red soap? Aha! Yes! Thank you very much. And then if I go here, and then I'll just make my. Weapon is complete. It's time to go and see the doctor. Ahaha! <laughs> Let's go and give him a nice, you know, visit. I don't really understand the point of the doll's head, though. Attack! I need a weapon. Thank God I have this! You feel, uh. Oh, I gotta deliver a killing line. What's it? You'll feel a sharp scratch. What's up, Doc? Do you believe in karma, Doc? Oh, but see you in hell. I'm gonna go with, do you believe in karma, Doc? Do you believe in, in karma, karma, Doc? doc? Fwap! Booyah! Dead. Girl. Thank you. Thank you so much. No problem. It is. He would have. He would have killed me. Like the others. The animal. You, you gave him what he deserved. Who are you? My name is Susan Ash Ashworth. They call me the Cat Lady. Um. My name is Susan Ashworth. Now get out of here. Call the police. I'm going home. Finally! Jeez, that took me a long while. And that's the end of that chapter! Woo! Chapter 3! Yeah! River. But unfortunately, I'm not going to do that chapter because... Oh, hello, what's this? Standing by the river, I wonder... Do I need a stone? 
No. My heart is heavy enough. It will drag me down for sure. Oh, something, something. First of all, I should wash off all these horrible memories of this night. I'm dying for a shower. Something to eat. Some coffee. A cigarette. I love to see my cats too. Let's just pretend for a minute that everything is back to normal. I survived after all. Maybe now I can try to enjoy a little things in life. Yeah, okay. Yeah, I could do this. One at a time. Right, save the game. Oh, save the game. Uh, the game. What should we call this? Uh, Tom 2. Save. Game save to sex film. Okie dokie, guys. There you go. There was the cat lady. Uh, and, yeah, I'm enjoying this a lot. And, it's, and it seems like um, this may have to go on in an hour. And, you know, most people don't really want to see hour-long gameplays. I, can, I know that, but um, it just seems like that to me. But, hey, I think at least it's not going to be over an hour long. It will probably be around about 40 minutes. Cause I will, or maybe 30 if I'm lucky. Because, um, like I said, I'm going to cut out the part where I'm just endlessly looking around. Because it, it'd be rather boring to see that in an hour. But anyways, if you enjoyed this video, why don't you like, comment, favor, and subscribe. And I will see, well, blah, blah, blah. like, comment, video, and subscribe to see more content like this. And I will see you all in the next video. Bye-bye.